in everything. He didn't falter in anything. More so than Moses. And Moses was faithful. But yet, Jesus Christ was even more faithful. And also Moses was faithful in all his house. For this man was counted worthy of more glory than Moses. And so much as he who hath built the house has more honor than the house. For every house is built by some man. But he that built all things is God. And that's the reason he says that we're the temples of the Holy Ghost. We are the houses that are made by God. We are the sanctuary. We are the place of his inhabitation. Hallelujah. We are the ones that he abides in us and we abide in him. We learn to live in him. Hallelujah. And if we learn to live in him, then we'll learn to walk in him. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. And Moses was, barely was faithful in all his house as a servant for a testimony of those things which were to be spoken after. But Christ as a son over his own house, whose house are we? If we hold fast the confidence and the rejoicing of a hope firm unto the end. And that's, to me right there, that just kind of shatters that once saved, always saved. Right there. He's telling us we have to hold this firm unto the end. The confidence in Jesus Christ. Confidence in what he has spoken to us. Confidence in what he has put in us. That's the reason the Lord has really been moving upon my heart and my spirit in the last few weeks on the visions and the vision that he had put in my heart and spirit for this area here. He said, did I not show you? Did I not tell you? Did I not speak these things to you? I said, yes, Lord, you did. Lord, you said you'd bring them to pass. And Lord, I know that you will. Father, I know that you will. And in prayer, every day, the Lord has been showing me faces. He's been showing me, hallelujah, ones coming in and setting and be partaking of this work right here. And I said, God, thank you. I said, Lord, I appreciate you, Jesus, for putting that encouragement in my heart and my spirit. And I said, Lord, I'm going to persevere because you're putting that perseverance in